My name is Shannon Dosmegan, and I'm a co-founder and executive director of Public Lab. So Public Lab is a global open community that's supported by a nonprofit organization. Um, we come from many walks of life. Uh, we're technologists and community organizers, educators, urban planners, scientists, and we're interested in creating low-cost, do-it-yourself style tools for environmental monitoring. The BP oil disaster happened, and this was the, the first um, event, I guess you could say, that brought together um, some of the initial co-founders of Public Lab. And one of the first things that many of us um, in New Orleans and Southeast Louisiana saw was that there was a just general media blackout, um, that it was hard to get information coming um, off of the Gulf where the, the spill had happened, um, but that we knew there were impacts that were going to be seen and, and felt. So we started our, our first project, Aerial Map sending up into the air five and a half foot helium balloons um, or nine foot kites that were attached to a kite string with the top of a two liter soda bottle cut out so you could use it as a stabilizer for a basic point and shoot camera. Uh, we would send the, the aerial mapping rig 1500 to 2000 feet in the air and we collected hundreds of thousands of images. When thinking about how to create Public Lab, we wanted people to be able to interact in all stages from problem identification to tool development, data collection, data analysis, and then the advocacy components. We have quite a few tools that uh, different people in the community are working on. We have hacked cameras, uh, basic consumer cameras that we've turned into near-infrared sensing units. Uh, we have DIY spectrometers. Um, we have uh, water sensing units that can look at uh, conductivity. Um, and we have several different air projects going on related to uh, indoor air quality, as well as looking at dust coming from sand frack mining sites. It matters that um, low-cost tools exist so that people can become uh, participants and members of the, the narrative and the decisions that are happening about their communities. Because of the open uh, source methodology that's embedded in the work that we do, um, we have seen the, the different types of use scenarios really range across the board. Um, you know, so whether it's looking at the destruction of wetlands in Louisiana to monitoring an EPA Superfund site in New York City, the point of Public Lab in our community is to, to create a place where people can bring those different uh, knowledge sets and, and build and uh, create and solve problems together. My name is Shannon Dosmegan and I'm an Ashoka Fellow.